Hello friends, I am going to show you some report tips, tips like if you go to journal data, journal ledger, main account, and here is main account. If you go to posted button here you can see the data of particular account if you click on personalize then you can get the table name of journal journal entry like in previous version of ax you are using ledger trans table in ax digital it is journal journal entry table and journal journal account table if you see the difference then other table you will get journal journal account entry table same data of main account posted data if you want to take a report then how can you make the report i will give some tips will not show everything so first you need to create a table temporary table and take the required create column for required field like accounting date accounting name to check the size and name you can go to journal general account entry table here if you want currency amount just you copy then you go to a template table just paste it so this way you can create table easily so if you check the table name and properties size will come automatically once you created the temporary table like here we have taken mostly we need accounting date account name account number okay, who is created created date description what is document date document number exchange rate general number ledger account posting type reporting currency transaction type transaction currency code type and voucher this field we have taken second thing is you need to create a query i have taken journal journal entry query uh, this is a table of journal journal entry which we can use for filtering purpose then you need to go to create dp class in dp class you need to add your contract class attribute then you need to add query you need to define variable of temporary table then i have defined both table as a variable then after that you need to initialize query query run query build data source query build main account contract class and how you will make contract class here i have made it contract class one par method we have taken right label value will be from date position will be one what it will return same way for to date and declare the variable in class integration for contract class same contract class we have defined in dp class we have it extended data provider base and pre -pro if you want to debug the report then you can use SRS report data provider pre-process if you don't want to debug then you can use this this is basically used with temporary table and this is with regular tables then we have uh, 
create initialize query query build data source query build range we have an initialize object of query this is par query and contract class we have declared here with the methods and from it we have written from contract class and edit this table to your query build data source and after that i have added accounting date as range then query run dot next if you do and you can take this way value to query journal journal entry right this was simple report so we have di i have directly taken a while loop and whatever value is coming to this object we have given loop to journal journal account entry in this may be single entry and in this may have multiple entry of our voucher lines and then we have added a uh, inserted accounting date and if you want to take account number then you just need to go to main account find by ledger dimension pass the ledger dimension and get main account for name you can use this method or you can by find by name also then we have assigned the other fields to temporary tables and this is converting enum to a st string posting type enum to string for types and sub ledger voucher as a voucher we have inserted one control class we have defined and here in SSS report design we have passed in control class main method pre modified and report name is get report name same we have given the start operation control class declaration you need to extend SSRS report run controller and in DP class you need to extend SSR report data provider base and in contract class you don't need to extend anything is its use for defining the parameter for reports and that that things you can do design in report how to design report we have already clips in other video you can visit to my channel to how to design the report and get the uh, see the clip so here yeah, this clip will be complete with designing the reports so in this clip you have the got the idea how to create data provider report and how to use control class how to use dp class how uh, if you like this clip please don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you very much